While everyone is focused on meme coins and senseless degeneracy with literally no utility, I think it's time we shift our focus a little bit and we start paying attention to what is happening right now in DeFi. I'm talking about Ox. Oxcoin is the cornerstone of gamified derivatives exchange. No other DEX can even come close and compete with Ox, in my humble opinion. Let me explain why precisely. But before, I should disclose I am Gigalong Ox, together with my dear friend and epic trader GCR, as you can see on Arkham Intelligence, with a position of almost a million dollars. The platform provides a gamified trading experience with deep liquidity on all popular pairs and best in class exchange tokenomics. Oxcoin is used as the collateral and the PL currency of the exchange. As we can see on CoinMarketCap, Oxcoin is currently sitting at a 50 million market cap right now. And as we can see on the website, it's all about gamifying crypto with perps trading. Part of this gamification is prison locking. In prison locking, you lock your tokens and you can get up to almost 10% APR for 360 days of locking and basically you're earning a percentage of the revenue of the token and you're getting paid while traders are getting liquidated if you go on missions here on ox you have all sorts of missions where you can earn extra ox tokens for example let's look at mission one you called your size is not size hodl a 1x or greater leverage position and if you do if you hold a 1x leverage trade you must hold that position for the entire 24 hour period to complete the mission and you can start earning tokens you have other missions like Feed the Ox or Shepherd the Herd and for example, on mission 3, Shepherd the Herd, your trade volume must be at least 50% relative to your Ox balance. For example, if your Ox balance is 1 million Ox, you must trade at least half a million in Ox in futures within a 24 hour period. And if you start doing these missions, you can earn a lot of Ox while you're doing your regular trading. And so here in Ox, it's all about gamification. And this is how this exchange actually differentiates itself from every single other exchange in the market right now. And you can also trade meme coins on it and you can provide meme coins currently as collateral. For example, you can do this with MOG. In traditional markets, they call this type of DEX a quantum swap. So you may be wondering, what is a quantum swap? A quantum swap is a cash settled cross currency interest rate swap where one of the counterparties pays a foreign interest rate to the other. The notional amount is then denominated in the domestic currency. So you may be wondering, Gustavo, what the hell are you talking about here? I don't understand what a quantum swap is. Let me explain simply. A quantum is any type of derivative instrument that is settled in a different currency than the underlying asset. So this basically means on Ox, you can have, like I was saying previously, a meme coin like MOG and use it as collateral to long or short or any other meme coin pairs as the DEX allows. In fact, Suzu and Kyle said on a Spaces on X the other day, anyone could create OX pairs with up to 5k in liquidity, paired of course to the OX token, and they would be open to list it on the exchange for trading. So if you want to promote your meme coin, you have a roadmap here to get it listed on an exchange. Essentially, Suzu and Kyle and the team wants to take what made FTX big instead of totally shying away from it, but build what can be called anti-fragile over leverageification of crypto collateral. Sue and Kyle are going in the total opposite approach of what we had with FTX. Listen carefully, the main difference here with Ox is in the details. The conclusion taken is that USD is in fact the issue and why. USD is a non-crypto native asset which can always cause insolvency or bankruptcy. If instead the entire system is denominated in AUX, the tokens deposited will always be deposited against the AUX token. And if liquidated, tokens are sold into AUX, removing that middleman and bankruptcy risk and making the whole system decentralized and also open is what settles this DEX apart from the rest. And it's also why I'm so bullish to ride these whales back. Ox is not only at the forefront of DEXs right now, it's also what I consider to be a hated rally, which means usually the most hated concepts and tokens tend to also appreciate the most, just like we're seeing with Athena right now. Ox not only settles itself apart from the other exchanges in this aspect, it also gives amazing rewards and is perfectly aligned with crypto ethos and crypto culture. So let's talk a little bit about Ox rewards. Traders can complete daily trading missions and earn up to 200% APY yield on their OX. They can participate in these trading competitions 
And one very interesting thing you can do on Ox, as you can see here on the website, is do copy trading. For example, look at the battle vaults. In the battle vaults, you can see Suzu competing with Kyle. Currently, Suzu is up almost 15 million Ox and Kyle is down 2 million. And what you can do is you can choose one of them to copy trade and you can just ride their backs. You don't have to do any thinking at all. <laughs> if you want and if you think Suzu is a great trader, for example, which I think everyone does, you can just copy trade him on his exchange. Who else does this? No one. This is full transparency and is incredibly, incredibly fun. You can also copy trade one of the best traders in this game, which is Ox Dao, which I also recommend you give him a follow and as you can see all of these trades here are all 100% transparent another thing that sets ox apart is when you lose you earn a token called milk yes that's right when you lose you earn milk so as you can see this really is gamifying all of crypto and is also making it fun and it's also aligning this decks with the true ethos of crypto, crypto culture and crypto sense of humor. One important note, Ox.fun allows users to convert their OPNX, their open exchange token, which is OxV1 into the current Ox coin, which is OxV2 for a limited time. OxV2 will be minted on a one-to-one -one basis while all the OxV1 or tokens received for the swap will be burned. Now let's talk a little bit deeper about Ox culture alignment. You can hear Sue, Kyle, and Lucas podcast on Ox Media. Just click on the link down below and you go on their YouTube page of Ox Media. You can also follow Ox down below. He makes really long, interesting, and funny threads where he hides the alpha there in the middle, just like he did recently with Athena. Over here on the Ox Media YouTube page, you can watch podcasts, for example, Suzu's Prison Break, where he talks about how prison was, uh, which is pretty based. And you can also see Charlotte Fang from Romelia where they talk about crypto culture, they talk about the Milady NFTs and Remilios, etc. You can watch uh, whales like this uh, character called Crypto SFO, and which is a very, very interesting podcast as well. And Ox is producing some of the best media content in crypto right now. Lucas is an amazing addition and they make an amazing trio and they are launching these episodes weekly with a bunch of different guests. And these are the reasons why I think the Ox token will do extremely well this cycle because it's aligned with crypto culture, because they have amazing rewards, they have a really, really good product, and it is extremely different from every single other DEX. And the cherry on top of the cake, it will be a hated rally, because a lot of the crypto hate towards Sue and Kyle is misplaced. A lot of these people just hate on them, even though they did absolutely nothing to them. So I am extremely bullish Ox, and I think you should all click on the link down below and try it for yourselves. Full disclosure, it's one of my biggest positions, so thank you very much i hope you have enjoyed this video i hope to see you guys on the next one please 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 like subscribe follow me on my twitter and follow my dear colleagues sheldon kyle and dylan because these guys are also very good traders and you can learn a lot from them all the links are down below and i will see you guys on the next one